So, how's it going, everyone? Sorry, um, I'm being a little quiet. My uh, my throat really hurts. Uh, I actually shouldn't be talking right now. Um, but um, I'm here to make a new video. Um, as you can see, it's another speed paint, and um, the reason why it's a speed paint is um, so I was talking to someone not too long ago, about a few days, depending on how long this video takes to upload um i um i was talking to someone and they found out that i was an artist and you know the usual question is hey can you draw me um and you know normally i'm kind of snarky about it and like nah you know just i just refuse outright but this time I, it got me thinking because I don't tend to draw people ever. I, A, haven't practiced enough, and B, I don't feel like I would do their face justice. And so, what we're doing today is actually, I wanted to do a self-portrait of myself. Um, so you could see kind of what I look like, but at the same time, just seeing what I could do when it comes to drawing people. Now, I have a reference pulled up of a picture I took that same night. As you can see, it's about 2, 3 in the morning, or uh, something along those lines when I'm recording this. And, um, it's, uh, it's, I mean, it's late. It's just one of those nights that I couldn't really sleep. One of the things that I noticed when making this video, or recording and doing the art for this video is that I have a lot of insecurities um, I have a hefty amount of insecurities and now what do I mean well you will we'll get to it and in, in, in later in the video here but I don't like the way some of my uh, uh, just features are for example like and like I said, we'll get to that part later. For example, my nose. I kept fidgeting with the nose so much because it seemed too big. And that's just, that made me realize something. That I see myself subconsciously as having such a big nose. Or like being chubbier than I am. Or like, you know, giving myself less of features or giving myself more features. Like the eyes on this one. I made them bigger than my eyes normally are. And, um... You're looking at the reference now on screen, but the I'm going to take a picture of myself and and post it um, on the screen right now so you can see kind of what I'm going off of. I am. Um, I have like I said, I have a, a fair amount of insecurities, um, but why did I decide to make this video in the first place? Well, uh, as you know, I am a streamer on Twitch twitch.tv slash goosebrigader if you want to check me out if not that's cool i'm a streamer on twitch and i don't show my face whenever i stream i tend to hide behind this avatar that you're probably also seeing on screen right now and i don't like having my webcam on or having my face cam on because I'm very self-conscious about the way I look. I always have been, and I think I will be for a long time. Um, but the reason I decided to make this video was because I was hanging around on TikTok, and um, I saw a few posts of, you know, people having issues with body positivity, and I it got me thinking, you know? what what about me per se like what is it that i see about myself or what is it that i don't see about myself am i positive about my body am i negative towards the way i look and uh, i wanted to you know just kind of draw myself because through the eyes of an artist uh you know you tend to see things a little bit differently and oh boy did I see things differently I um 
I saw myself in a whole new light. But basically, I wanted to see what it would look like, it, you know, d defining the features that I needed to define and, you know, j just highlighting what I felt was a flaw. So I made this video and already right off the bat, you can see that the nose is huge. And that's because that's one of my biggest insecurities. So as you can see, immediately I, I start to fiddle with the nose I started to try to make the nose a little bit bigger I tried to, because it didn't seem right I was looking at the reference picture while I was doing this trying to get proportions correctly and as you can see the nose like doubled in size because it, it's, subconsciously I think that I have a big nose you know it's one of the things that I point out to myself here clearly because in my brain I don't see it as having a small nose or a relatively like you know fitting nose for my face I just think it's a big nose and that's one of the things that I noticed when I was painting um, that I do that I also like I said I made my eyes a little bit bigger because I my eyes are just small um, I'm a chubby dude I <laughs> I made myself look a little fatter than I was for a second and I and that's that's kind of what triggered what I was saying I just I saw myself you know just bad really I also don't tend to smile a lot in pictures um, because I don't like the way I smile but this is more or less something that just says you know try to be more accepting of the way you look because that's just kind of who you are there's no point in trying to you know be someone you're not trying to look like something you're not and uh i you know i i enjoyed the way that this turned out i was actually very happy with the result of how this painting came out and you know that just kind of goes to show that no matter how how you see yourself there's always good there's always like you see yourself as a certain way but it's just something that you have to embrace you know you have to learn to embrace your flaws and embrace what makes you you and I mean that's just kind of what I wanted to make this video about just more or less body positivity because if someone like me who hides behind you know little uh, figures or little avatars or whatever can come out and be like hey this is me you know I like the way I look I you know I could do better sure but you know not no one is going to be more proud of the way that I am than myself you know I'm gonna see if I can find the video that actually got me thinking about this it's a video of a girl who's you know a little on the thicker side um, and she was um, talking about how guys think that she is sexy right because she's on the thicker side and she started saying that she didn't feel like that was the case or she didn't feel like blank was you know the case of uh you know she didn't feel like it was something that should merit men liking her and um she's probably never gonna see this video and that's fine I want to tell you that yes, you know, everyone's got different tastes. Everyone knows what they enjoy and what they like. And, you know, men like girls thicker. Those, those bits that you pointed out as flaws, people find attractive. People find sexy. There's nothing wrong with your body because, believe it or not, you are pretty damn sexy i'm just gonna say it and it's fine you know i 
I understand where they're coming from because I'm kind of in the same boat. I listen to my voice and I look at myself in the mirror and although to me I see myself as being attractive or having a decent voice or you know whatever I also in my brain feel like you know I'm not anyone's type and I get it you know it's just it's a little contradictory but that's kind of what I mean everyone has a type and everyone's going to you know tell you that you know oh you know every someone's bound to like you blah 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 you get it and it's true i know for a fact that you have to learn to accept yourself but not by yourself sometimes you need a little bit of help to try to accept who you are because when you find that person that you like and who likes you for who you are for what you look like for you know the way you act then what does it matter what does it matter what other people think just to yourself you know you're sexy as fuck and that's just a little bit of a of the message that i wanted to just say cuz everyone ever is sexy as fuck it's just that simple so yeah we're just gonna let this video finish playing out and uh i'll see you guys later take care